Hey guys, today I found something scary in our water. Now, I don't use my water for anything but washing dishes, but our water should be cleaner than this. But I've heard this, that if you're out in um, some of the provincial towns that have water out there and some of the provincial um, places that are really far from here, the water is not the greatest either and it's not really drinkable. But I mean, it's this is one thing you would never expect to find in your water, okay? And my girlfriend the other day was washing some food and I guess what happened was she found a couple of worms and she took the food out and it was two worms wiggling, two or three worms wiggling on the bottom. She actually did a video of it. And I was quite surprised when I heard about this for several reasons, because when I took showers before, okay, I would see worms wiggling on the floor. And I'm like, well, there's no cracks. There's no places where these can, are coming up. And, my, and I was telling my girlfriend, I says, I think I got worms. You know, like I was getting kind of afraid. Um, and, and most people probably in the Philippines do have worms, by the way. I just want to put that out there. But this was like a little bit different. I was like, man, I'm seeing worms on the floor. You know, and I went to the doctors, told the doctor, I says, there's no, pla no place else these worms could have came from except from, from me. And I'm thinking maybe they came out of, you know, the place that usually excretes, you know. So <laughs> I'm thinking that's where it came from. Well... Now that we know that the water has worms, and I, I heard from um, Justin's girlfriend, and she said that she's seen worms coming out of the water too, which is kind of gross, okay? So I would be very careful about your drinking water here. Yeah, it's okay to take showers and stuff like that. The water's pretty clean, but I'm not sure where these are coming from. If there's a crack in a pipe or something's going on around here. If, if it was a dirty pipe, maybe somebody stuck in there or they're coming from somewhere and they come from somewhere in the system. <clears throat> the amazing thing is, is not just like, like a few, it's probably like two or three a day we see. And also our shower heads tend to clog up and guess what it's from? It's probably from worms. And we thought it was from like maybe some sort of sediment or like maybe calcification you know if, if you have water that's hard water or whatever it calcifies or whatever you know but this is worms and that's kind of gross when you think about it and and the fact that you know if you have your mouth open when you're taking a shower which sometimes i do you know and you could be taking smaller worms maybe these weren't there's smaller worms in that water and i'd be careful about washing your fruit and vegetables about that stuff i would use blue jug water here i've talked about water before here is it okay to wash your food? Is it okay to brush your teeth with? Um, I'm thinking no now. You know, I'm changing my mind on this. And usually I don't change my mind because I've, I think this is something new around here. But I have heard when I talk to a couple of other guys around Luzon and also on some of the other islands, they said yes. They do see um, insects, and, insects and worms in their water sometimes. And it comes out through the faucet. And they're not sure where they come from because it comes up through that blue the blue thing, you know, into your house. So it could it be a crack or something. No, because a crack wouldn't let it in because it would be flushing water out really fast. So the worms got to be coming from probably the water processing plant or something like that. But I did want to put this out there today. <clears throat> I think it's kind of important that we put it out there. Be careful what you, you know, with your water, maybe put a filter on there, a faucet filter. I'm thinking about putting a faucet filter on mine and possibly even a shower filter now so that we can cut all that stuff out of there and get rid of that and, and and it might be for the best you might even want to put a whole house water filter on your on your, in your house so that your faucet water and your shower water are both clean now usually if you have a place that has low uh pressure it's gonna have a problem because it has to push through that filter so just be aware of that guys but anyway guys i did want to talk about that today a little bit um i did want to put out that warning um, it's not just a, a Tracy Materas thing. It's also, you know, other places too that have this, the same issues. But anyway, guys, God bless. Take care.